Math is delicious. Here is Krong Math. A Korean mathematician, Jin Young Park, proves the Kong Kola conjecture. Kalai said, It's strikingly simple and ingenious. Then, what is Kong Kola conjecture? Jeff Kahn and Glee Kali firstly proposed the expectation threshold conjecture in 2006. It is a strong conjecture about mathematical objects called random graphs. Threshold is about the threshold value where an astonishing phenomenon occurs. When the value is smaller than no, any impressive things happen. Imagine that we bake a pancake with a constant temperature. Under the threshold temperature, we cannot bake a pancake. We only can bake a pancake over the threshold temperature. Something special happens over the threshold. Actually, Kankalai conjecture is not about pancake. It is about random graph. They used an easy metaphor to explain the concept of the conjecture. Imagine a graph. Each vertices are connected with each other with an edge. A binary coin decides the connectivity of the random graph. Each binary coin is allocated to pairs of the vertices. A human flips the coin. When the coin shows the front side, we connect the two vertices each other with an edge. When the coin shows the back side, we do not connect the two vertices each other with an edge. This simple step continues to all other pairs of vertices. For every pair of vertices in the random graph, by default, the coin has 50% probability both for showing front side or back side. In the cone collect conjecture, we use biased coins. The probability for showing front side keeps increasing until something special happens. For an easy explanation, an easy example of something special happens is the random graph becomes heart shaped. This is just an example. I would like to explain the property in details with the words of mathematicians. Let the number of vertices in a random graph is n. When we connect the two vertices each other with a probability greater than log n divided by n, a Hamiltonian cycle becomes extremely likely. This threshold value is a true value. In most cases, this value is so difficult to calculate. Therefore, most mathematicians ask that what is the minimum possible true value for threshold. In this case, 1 divided by n is the expectation threshold, which is quite easier than calculating the true value. The conjecture is about the gap between the true value and the expectation threshold. The gap between the true value and the expectation threshold is smaller than the logarithmic factor. The conjecture was really difficult to prove, but there was a small evidence. The sunflower conjecture was the key. It is about the collections of sets may be constructed in methods that resemble the petal of a sunflower. There was a previous work related to sunflower conjecture, but it is not related to the Kahn Kali conjecture actually. Kahn and Park and their colleagues ended up linking the two and they show more easy version of the Kahn Kali conjecture. This was the starting point. Finally, they thought about the problem in terms of a mathematical object called a cover. A cover is a collection of sets whose union is the whole set. For the further explanation, please refer to the paper, A Proof of the Kahn-Kali Conjecture.